There are people we all watch on social media or on television, but realistically, we only really see a, a just a glimpse of the highlights of their life. You yeah, know, we don't know much of their story. Savannah Louie shows us the life of an all star isn't always glitz and glam. On hands and knees in ripped up jeans, Anthony Ryan spends his Wednesday mornings tidying up a shop. You walk into the shop and you see this kind of redneck country boy, like what the hell does he know about fashion? He says it's a fair question that can be answered a few hours later. Being on the show is insane. Uh, you kind of get used to it. I mean, this is my third round. While watching himself on national television, Boom. Anthony Ryan is a contestant on Project Runway All Stars International. <laughs> He's been on the show twice before, even winning an All Star season a few years ago. Yeah. But fully appreciating his designs walking down the runway requires a walk down memory lane. High fashion hasn't always been his aesthetic. I decided to go into graphic design. I didn't realize what I was getting into. I've always worked with my hands, I talk with my hands, um, and so I dropped out. It was only after feeling a little lost that Anthony Ryan turned to the thing he'd always had some sort of familiarity with. I'd been in retail since I was 15. It was an aha moment. Spinning thread got his wheels turning. He had a knack for shapes and styles, and even when he found one aspect a little murky, I'm colorblind. He used it to give his garments a personal flair. Primary colors, I work in a lot because they just are vivid as hell. I didn't make it a handicap, I just found a way around it. You'll find his original designs hanging wall to wall in his San Antonio shop, a boutique that is purely Anthony Ryan. What would you wear it with? I have no idea. From its name, Colorblind. It's two French words. It's a play on color uh, and blanc. So it means colored armor in French. To its design, Try on it. which weave the world's greatest fashion meccas into his small town roots. And while his day to day may not be as glamorous as a feature on a hit reality TV show. I love to teach in a lot of ways. It brings him something better than any prize he might win. I'm here helping people, you know, giving my advice, but I like to be able to put a little bit of my stank, so to speak, on uh, more of a Southern-based city. Savannah Louie, Ken's Five Eyewitness News. Now, if you want to go check out more from Anthony Ryan, his boutique um, color line is located on Broadway near the University of the Incarnate Word. He said a French word. Yeah, <laughs> Just a translation for it. <laughs> uh, yeah, not exactly <laughs> our strength there. <laughs> but I'm so looking forward to visiting his boutique. I mean, just from what we've seen here, the designs look really nice. That's a great job. 626, still to come this morning.